What would this great sport be without derby passion? Two teams who know plenty about each other, but aren't very fond of each other. We're live on EA TV. And this is the scene here at the home of Galatasaray in Istanbul. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Galatasaray, and they take on Fenerbahce. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And the starting 11 for Galatasaray. Fernando Muslera is the goalkeeper. Kerem Demirbay starts alongside Lucas Torreira in the middle of midfield. And leading the line today is Mauro Icardi. Genghis Under. And making sure there was no danger in the end. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Dusan Tadic plays with Cengiz Under on the flanks, and the lead striker today is Edin Dzeko. Well, Hakim Ziyech, a player who can really give opposing defences a torrid time of it. Stuart, what should we look forward to seeing from him today? Well, Derek, he has many attributes, but it's his crossing ability that makes him such an outstanding player. He can bend them in with pace between the goalkeeper and the defenders, stand them up to the far post, or chop it back onto his weaker foot to deliver dangerous crosses. Good distribution. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. Oh, great defending. Great effort to keep that one in play. Dusan Tadic. Fred with it. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Kerem Demirbay. Now with Cengi Zunder. He has time to play it over. Now the cut back. Can they forge ahead? Oh, my word. There's excellent timing for you. What a challenge. Icardi. Plenty of options. Mertens. Now with Ziyech. Mauro Icardi here to put them ahead. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Well, opting for the short corner. Pulls it back. Oh, genuine chance. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, they're going for the short one. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Jiku did well to win the ball back. Ferdi Kadioglu. Kadioglu. Osterwolde. Dusan Tadic. Jaden Osterwolde. Can they create something from here?
It did look on for them, but not to be. Ziyech. Here's Icardi. Ziyech. We wondered who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Ziku. Sebastian Szymanski. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Genghis Under! A goal! They've opened the scoring in the derby. And I'll tell you what, you can hear a pin drop in here. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Nelson. Lucas Torreira now. Ziesch. Well, a struggle for Galatasaray to keep possession here. Jekko. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Torreira. Demir Bay has it. Lucas Torreira now. Ziesch. Kerem Demir Bay. And Mertens must score. An alert piece of defending. Now, well, maybe room here for the counter attack. Jekko. Back to Undead. Fred. Oh, surely. And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. And so it is, the first half story has been written. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. And a timely intervention. Reese Mertens. Szymanyski. And it's a quality pass. And able to close down the shot. And the substitution will occur now. They take it short. Jekko. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Icardi. Ziesch. 
Kerem Aktürkolu. Mertens, and will it be the leveller? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? And a short corner, let's see. Derek Kern. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Szymaniewski. Now with Mertens. Kerem Demirbay. Demirbay. Mauro Icardi here. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Dusan Tadic. Dzeko. He's foiled them on his own. Icardi. Icardi. And here's Ziyech. Timely intervention. Zeyunchu. Tadic has it. Tadic. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. And into the last 20 minutes. Derek Kuhn. Here's Icardi. Well, patient passing could be the key to bringing themselves level. Well, it was a good-looking sequence, but it comes to an end. Dzeko. On to Cengiz Under. And passing it through. And a goal it is! They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Kuhn. Lucas Torreira now. Ziyech. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Zeyunchu. Fred with it. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Really annoying for them. Couldn't take advantage. Running with the ball confidently. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, nearly there. This game almost over. And looking at the fans, Stuart, they appear to me to be more than a bit gutted. Well, I think they've been a bit unlucky today. They certainly haven't been two goals worse than their opponents. But in key moments, they've just been found wanting, particularly defensively. Oh, Stuart, they've got to score! And the challenge, crisp and clean. He's protecting it well. Pressing high to win the ball. Ooh. 
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Mauro Icardi here. Jaden Osterwalde. Clean challenge. Kerem Akturkolu. Oh, he's lost possession. He cuts it back. Real chance. And the keeper there to deal with it. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, Stewart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.